A car initially traveling 24.0 meters per second speeds up at a rate of 4.00 meters per second squared for 3.2 seconds. All right, so in this problem, it's a one-dimensional motion problem, so I'm looking for three given. I've highlighted three numbers, so that's a good sign. So, car is initially traveling 24.0 meters per second. That is our initial velocity. Speeds up at a rate of 4.0 meters per second squared. That is going to be our acceleration. I can tell by those units. For 3.20 seconds. I should note that those velocities and accelerations are positive because the positive direction is to the right. The velocity is increasing, becoming more positive. All right, so next thing I can do is I can find the final velocity using initial velocity plus acceleration times time. So 24 plus 3.2 times 4 gives me 36.8 meters per second. And that's going to be our first answer. It says how far did the car travel during this time? Okay, so to find the displacement, I'm, in this problem I'm going to go straight to the displacement and use initial velocity times time plus one half the acceleration times the time squared. So I'm plugging in right now 24 times 3.2 plus 1 half times 4 times 3.2 squared. That gives me 97.28. I want to keep three significant figures or 97.3 meters. 